Hi, I'm Galen. I'm an arborist community expert. And this is how I tie off the tail end of a pull line. So I've got one end of my rig line attached to the top of the tree I want to pull over. I take the other end and I'm going to anchor it to this tree. So I walk around. And then tension it up. If I got extra crew with me, everybody can get on and get it real tight. Now you can hold friction with this hand, hold tension, get friction around the trunk and it keeps it from slipping back on you. At this point, you're gonna to wanna to take your rope over and back. And then without letting go of that tension, take a little bit more going back this way. And I'm gonna walk around the back of the tree. And at some point around the back, I'm going to cross over, make a pinch point, give a little bit of extra friction. And when I get back to the front, still keeping tension, once again, I'm going to take the rope over, back behind itself to make a half hitch. Cinch it down tight, and then I'll make a second half hitch, usually on a bite, just to secure that first one. And now your line's tied off solid, comes undone again easy. I usually combine this with a three to one mechanical advantage system. I use the Rosenvink cinch. And if it's just me and my groundy, we can actually get tension on this line equal to six people on a straight pull. And then when I go to cut that tree, he can be over here on one leg of that three to one. Pulling a little side pull, giving it a little extra tension and taking up slack as it comes over.